Kitty Cancer. So my office is temporarily unavailable. So I'm gonna just talk to you guys about this here. I did write it down so I don't forget what I was picking up on. Um, so the first thing I was getting is you have somebody's attention. So I do feel like this is somebody new. Um, I don't know why they're telling me Leo, but maybe it's a Leo. But you have somebody's attention right now. Also, someone has been thinking about you. I do feel like they will try and reconcile with you. Um, could be a friend, whoever, but do know that somebody does have you on their mind. So if you've been thinking about this person a lot too, it's because um, they've been thinking about you as well. Uh, also a Taurus, being distant. That message might only be for a couple of you, but I do feel like this person is being distant on purpose and there are some things that they're not telling you. So yeah, I do want to give a big thank you, of course, to everyone who has joined my Patreon, also to everyone who has subscribed to my second channel. The links to both of those will be down below. Um, I am doing Vlogmas, so do be sure you go check out my vlogs. So yeah. Also, for those of you interested in ordering a personal reading, you can visit my website at swordstarot.com where I have different options of different readings you can purchase. And just one of the messages for Cancer. Okay, so we got the Eight of Pentacles coming out. A lot of you guys are focused on what you can create. And I do feel like some of you guys are even overwhelming yourselves a little bit. Ten of Wands energy. Maybe you just got a lot on your plate a lot to um, do as far as work or business. I do feel like a lot of you guys are just in kind of grind mode right now. Of course, the holidays are coming. So some of you guys may be wanting to save for that or wanting to recover from that. If you have spent a lot this month, we do have the eight of wands energy here as well. So do know that the efforts that you're putting in, you're absolutely going to get the results and the energy that you've put in right back. Um, I do feel like for a lot of you, this is a successful business. Maybe this is a new business um or maybe something you've been working on for a while but regardless i do see you finding success um in achieving some sort of milestone or some sort of goal now we do have the king of swords energy here you could be getting um communication from an air sign gemini Libra, aquarius i'm also getting strong virgo energy here and sagittarius as well i do feel like somebody maybe wants to reach out to you justice card energy uh yeah i feel like you're going to be getting some clarity or some information about something like I was kind of saying in the beginning I, I was already feeling that uh, somebody is thinking about you and of course this could be somebody um, from your past so we do have the two of cups and the star card some of you guys we deal with an Aquarius I'm um, also getting strong Libra energy here as well but I do see someone wanting to connect with you whether this is somebody new somebody you already know uh, whatever the case is I do feel like for a lot of you a lot of you people this is someone new um, I do see you or I do see them wanting to connect with you and I do see you guys um possibly moving forward with something more serious um we do have the three of swords energy here so i definitely feel some of you may be experiencing um some heartbreak why is it three of swords energy here okay so this message might only be for a couple people but i do feel like some of you found out someone was manipulating you or someone was trying to manipulate you in a situation and i do feel that could have led to maybe a breakup of course heartbreak it's always difficult to deal um with a situation like that why is the eight of pentacles energy here Ooh, two of cups okay so the two of cups coming out again yes i definitely see a very strong connection here with you for some of you this is a co-worker um wanting to connect with you but do know that um you're going to be connecting with someone i definitely feel for some of you singles you're not going to be single out there uh, for much longer for sure why is the ten of wands energy here i actually see a connection maybe it wasn't even intended for this connection to do whatever maybe you've just been kind of going with the flow um, but I definitely do feel that it's actually going to lead somewhere. So we do have the 10 of wands energy clarifying that we are the, yeah, clarifying that we have the queen of cups. So yeah, overwhelmed. Um, I definitely do see some of you guys overwhelmed with work, just responsibilities, the holidays, um, all of that. Do know that that energy is going to us going to subside here pretty soon. Um, we do have the four of pentacles energy here in the eight of wands. So I do feel like advice to kind of, um, give away all that stress put the stress down i definitely do feel advice is to um, move slower maybe some of you guys are just moving really fast right now trying to get shit done trying to get shit purchased i do feel like advice is to slow down a little bit um take a second to think take a second to breathe and not uh, try not to worry so much because i do feel like you are going to really overwhelm yourself um with everything that you're doing i just feel a lot of you guys may have just a lot on your plate right now maybe work is crazy um but i do feel like things are going to start to calm down why is the king of swords energy here Ooh, so we have the queen of wands and the death card okay so i feel like for some of you someone has gone cold in a relationship or in a situation of course this could represent your energy i actually feel with the death card the king of swords some of y'all are done dealing with someone's shit 
it could be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sag, but I do feel like some of you are, are going to walk away from a situation. Maybe someone has, you know, broke your heart for the last time. Maybe you're done giving chances, or I do feel like advice is to be done giving chances and give yourself time to heal. Tempest card energy. So yeah, I do know something's going to come out. Why is the justice card here? This is getting information. This is getting clarity. Yeah, judgment in the Six of Swords. Some of you guys are going to decide to walk away uh, from whatever this is. For those of you that do get um, some information that is not going to be good. I'll just tell you that right now. It's it's not going to be good. It's going to be sad. It's going to be heartbroken, but I, uh, heartbreaking. But I do feel like the reason this is being presented to you is because it's time to walk away from this. Or time to move on and just allow yourself to heal and move forward. Okay, hello. Why is the Two of Cups energy here? Ooh, Six of Cups, okay, and the Knight of Wands. Do you know for some of you this is going to be a past person wanting to come back? I'm getting Aquarius, Fire Sign, Gemini, um, whoever, but do know Nine of Wands energy, this person moves fast. They come and go. So I definitely feel for those of you that do have a past person, maybe you have been kind of tempted to talk to them, or maybe you have missed them a little bit. Don't allow yourself to go get balls deep in your feelings because this person, they're not going to be consistent. Um, they're, I feel like they're just going to come, you know, have fun, whatever, and then go again. So definitely don't, I almost want to say don't fall for this person's shit if they do. And I feel like they're going to come back real strong. Like, oh yeah, I've missed you. Da, 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 everything's great. And then it's like, they're just going to leave. So yeah, definitely be careful as far as, you know, reconciling with a past person. I do feel like they will reach out. Clarifying the star, we have the hermit card. So I love this because it makes me feel like regardless of anything that you're going through, work drama, family drama, relationships, do know that everything you're going through is a part of your path and it is a lesson that you need to learn for the future. So hermit card energy confirming you are on the right path. Um, especially if things may be difficult right now, but do know that everything's going to be okay. I love that the star and temperance are out in your reading because both of these cards represent healing. So do know that whatever it is that you've gone through, you are healing from it. And things are just going to start making sense because, you know, if you think about it, like past situations, um, you'd be like, oh, wow, you know, I'm really glad I got out of it. This is just another one of those. Um, shit's going to start looking a lot more clear and start making sense for the next couple of weeks. You'd be like, oh, damn. Okay. Yeah. Maybe that did need to happen. So clarifying the three of swords, we have the king of wands. Some of you guys are dealing with the fire sign. Um, I do feel like this person, for one, I will say, I do feel like you and this person were meant to be together for that period of time. But do you know if things are falling apart right now? It's because um, it's time to move on. It's time to move forward to something better. I definitely do feel this was a lesson type of situation that you were supposed to learn with this person. Um, you get a strong Sagittarius energy here. But yeah, do know that, you know, if this situation is not going well, it's not for you. But it was necessary and it was something that you had to go through. So clarifying the magician, we have the Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, a lot of y'all have manifested money here. Manifested money, inheritance, success. So I do feel like this could be another reason that this energy, whether this is a friend, a family member, whoever, just cannot be in your life because you're moving forward. It's, it's your time. It's time for you to be successful. Um, time for you, for your art to be shown, or your work to be shown, or like whatever. It's time for that. And this person, unfortunately, cannot come along with the ride with you. I don't want to say just this ride to success. I definitely see... Um, a lot of good energy coming your way just as far as you know yourself your life your path career all of that and Russ, what is the advice for cancer Ooh, full card energy and the nine of pentacles okay and the ace of cups at the bottom of the deck so i will say um advice for some of you not to look for new love because you know when we look for love we always get the wrong shit so i definitely feel advice is to wait for new love to come in um for those of you that are you know maybe in this difficult situation for those of you that are single um i definitely do see love coming in and um, full card in that of pentacles this is saying go for it whatever it is whatever you want to pursue business wise financially your talent, your skills, whatever it is, advice is to go for it because I see you being extremely successful. I love that we go um, from the Eight of Pentacles to the Nine of Pentacles to the Ten of Pentacles. Like there's just so much good financial energy coming your way. So I do hope that this reading was helpful for you guys. If you would like a personal reading, you can visit my website at swordstarot.com and I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day.